Hello everybody, welcome to the card for GFW Extreme Rules this Sunday, the 26th of September at 8pm UTC. Jimmy Fantastic on Twitch and here to talk me through it is Fimir. Hello. Hello everybody and get ready for Sunday, 8pm UTC. Just a little after the final of the CCL Cup, the main event of the week begins. Oh yeah. And here we have the first match, the WM Dope Open Challenge. Borg Fagor, the unstoppable beastman that have transitioned from human, we are not very sure about that, to beastman, has to face a mystery opponent which nobody knows who's going to be. And it's an open challenge, so anyone can come and take the belt. Yeah, I mean, he has been, he's looked pretty much unstoppable since this transformation, but uh, yeah, anyone in the back could come out and, and have a go for that title. No idea who it's going to be. I mean, end of the day, you can give a clown a small shoes instead of big shoes, but he's still a clown. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> these have all got little shoes, these fellas. <laughs> Blim Plum Blasterweight Championship Elimination. Here we have Lebred Mask, Papa Piquillo, and... Crispy that... Ice. <laughs> Who's that the other guy? Crispy Ice. Crispy eyes, Jesus. I've been away for a week and everything changes here. <laughs> so, fighting, trying to take the belt from Lebrun Max. He has to defend his belt in many circumstances, and this is going to be the most extreme of, of all of them, because clearly these two opponents will do anything to achieve anything in life, and getting the Plim Plum Prize World Championship is the dream for them. Yeah, and... Uh... The Bread Mask has been in action every week since winning the title, and these are the only two that have got the best of him, so this is going to be very exciting. And then, oh baby, it's the Two oh, Heads baby. Championship. Two Heads Championship, two ways of seeing wrestling. The friendship versus the business. The glorious one, after earning the title in um, the last pay-per-view, now they have to defend it against Business is good, Lemon is good, and Fox Mini, Fun Fox, sorry, <laughs> too many foxes in the GFW, oh, god damn it. There's a lot of foxes, yeah. Have to, are finally targeting the belt, doing the ultimate business transaction, going from nobodies to champions. <laughs> but will be the, will they be glorious enough to be the actually glorious ones? You'll have to watch that Sunday. Yep. Oh, ho, ho. and now for the GFW World Championship, a contest of gods versus good boys. Johnny B. Good, the revelation of the GFW since the storybook brawl became a thing, <laughs> maybe unrelated, who knows, facing Thor, an unstoppable Asgardian machine of destruction and justice that is not going to give away his belt under any circumstance. So Johnny B. Good is going to need to be particularly good that night to be able to have a chance to become a champion. Yeah, Thor's been amazing since winning the belt, but, uh, you know, Johnny B. Good, he is the good boy. The good boy's pretty overpowered, so we'll, we'll see. We'll see what he can do. And now you're waiting for this to answer the question, who's the biggest? At the GFW, we have a Clash of the Titans match here. Pepper Biscuit versus Goliath Game. <laughs> versus The Mask. Who's going to happen here? It's going to be absolutely horrible. I don't recommend watching this in front of children <laughs> because there's going to be blood, at least blood, and who knows what else because these two are fighting for the pride, for the bragging rights of being the biggest man in the GFW. Yeah, can't wait to watch this one. Fua. <laughs> and finally, the fight that's been in the making for years since the day each one of these men were born and died. <laughs> uh, this thing has been in the making. The extras belt on the line, but there is much more than that. In one corner, Rick Redless, a man that has to face all his fears, a man that has to prove to himself that he still has it. A man that wants to look in the eyes of his little daughter and tell her, Daddy still has it. 
has to face in Hell in a Cell his worst nightmare, Night Demon, the person in the other corner, the absolute king of the GFW, but a man assorted in all fronts, have to fight every single person in the GFW week after week, losing control of obviously and dead army slowly. And now, finally, he has to face the only one he wasn't able to completely destroy. He has to finish the job. Will he be able to do that? Will you watch that Sunday, 26th of September, 8 p.m. UTC? Yeah, it's going to be amazing. 15-minute Hell in a Cell Iron Man match. That's just going to be an epic confrontation, those two. Rick fine, looking for final revenge after getting his leg broken in that vicious match um, at SummerSlam. So, yeah, that's going to be, it's going to be amazing. And, uh, it's going to be amazing, and if anyone miss it, don't worry, we'll be on YouTube. But watching it live is what actually matters. <laughs> yes, it's going to be glorious. So uh, there you go. I've been Jimmy Ventura. Thank you very much, Fimey. You've been glorious as always. Okay, get ready, guys. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> and thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.